Well, Betty says her plan might have backfired on her. Oh. Betty, what's going on? I brought my daughter here because I love my daughter very yeah. much. Oh, well, good. Very yeah. much. And she's with a man that's not good for her. Oh, and you've been telling her that this guy isn't for good for her? For the last six years. For six years they've been together? Yes, two kids in six years. Oh. He's cheated well, on her. He's called her out of her name. He's left her twice, both times she was pregnant. I just... She doesn't need to be with him. Yeah. And I don't want her to fall in my footsteps. Oh, you had the same experiences? Yep, I did. Now, you are here, or why are you here? Because um, she's already heard this from you, I assume. Yeah, but I did something I shouldn't have done. Oh. Went a little too far. Well, but, well, yeah, well, what did you do? I have a uh, friend of mine that's a webcam model. Yes. And ask her to flirt with him. Oh, to set out, see if he would... See what if he would bite. Yeah. Because a couple months ago they split up and he said that he would change. He didn't. So when you said your friend there to start flirting with him... He... About a week ago she told me that they actually had sex. Oh. And it's my fault. It really is. So you want to tell your daughter that. But also it makes your point that... Yeah, but I don't think she's going to listen anyway. I don't think she's going to leave him. Well, your daughter is outside the studio, so she hasn't heard any of this. We'll bring her out, and you'll tell her. Here is Gabriel. You know I've been trying to get you to leave Junior since you got with him. Yeah, but that's my relationship. I know, but I don't want you to do what I did. You've seen what my relationship was like for 20 years. Why would you want to do 20 years from now be where I am? Because I have two kids. I want everything for my kids. I want everything for you and I want you to be happy. I am happy. You're not happy, honey. I can see it. You're just like I was at your age. You have two kids. I had three at your age. Okay, but I'm only 20. Okay. It's my life. I know. I'm sorry. But, uh, I brought you here to tell you something. I did something I shouldn't have done. And I'm going to tell you I'm sorry right now. And I love you with all my heart. But my friend Eva, she's a webcam girl. I asked her to flirt with Junior just to see if he would bite, I guess. And she told me about a week ago that they actually had sex. That they slept together. Are you serious? I'm sorry. It's my fault. You must have thought, even though I understand what your intention was, that whatever happened, she would resent this. Yes. And I took that chance. Thinking she would leave him. I hope she leaves him. I'm sorry. I didn't, I, I don't want to hurt you. I promise you, I don't want to hurt you. I love you with all my heart and your girls. Please don't hate if you me. you love me, why did you do that? Because he's done it so many times and he said he would change and he didn't. This last time he left, he said he would change. He didn't change. Even accepting that what your mom did, she shouldn't have done, okay? The fact is, he apparently did cheat again. So the anger with, at your mom, that will be for a while or whatever. But what about your relationship with him? If she's telling the truth that he does constantly cheat on you and he did it again after saying that he wouldn't, at some point 
does she have a point that, wow, is this going to be the home that my children are going to grow up in? She has a valid point, but it's... It's your life. My I life. I know it's your life and it's your mistakes to make. But can't you see you're making the same mistakes I did? I'm supposed to learn from my mistakes, correct? Yeah, and I'm trying to teach you from mine. Let's bring him out now, because I, I... And you can talk to him. Here's Junior. What is wrong with you? Oh, man. What's wrong with me? Your How many mom, times you left my daughter? Why would you do that? Whether she set it up or not, why would you do that? I uh, mean, what male ain't? Oh, it has nothing to do with you to be a male. No, it has nothing to do with you being a male. Yeah, I am. No, that's a sorry excuse. All right. So. Sorry, excuse. Your yeah. mother set me up. That's a sorry excuse. Okay. It doesn't matter if she set you up or not. You could have easily said no. You could have easily walked away from yeah. So it's okay for your mom to set me up. I need to fall for it. No, it's not. It's not okay. It's not okay. No, it's okay. not. She can but what me. you did wasn't okay either. All right. She what can I hate me for okay? the rest of my You're life as long as she leaves you. Oh, well, it happened. So, what? What happens after this? I mean, you're going to take the kids, leave me. What's going to happen? She can come home. I'm mom. obviously going to keep my kids. She can come I back home to mom. Kids. Okay. You go back to your mommy. Go live with your good old mommy. Go live with All of them. First off, I live with my stepmother. And second off, I'm grown. I don't know what you but don't understand about that. You're still going back to mommy? No, actually, I'm not. Okay, then what you doing? I'm going to take care of my kids like I've been doing. You look out. For what? Do, do you love her? Yeah, I love her. Did what I did show it? No. Okay. Do I have remorse? No. But. You don't have remorse? No. And you claim to love me? Yeah. If you honestly loved me, you wouldn't have did what you did. Okay. Look at the difference between being in love and loving somebody. I never said I was in love with you. I said I loved you. I mean... So were truth. you thinking about your kids at all in that situation? Honestly, no. No, you never do. I thought with the little head, not the big one. Yeah, you never do. Yeah, I know. And it's going gonna, it's gonna to hurt me. It's going to hurt my kids. No, it's going to hurt the kids. Well, I mean, at least they don't know what's going on. They're going to. How? My daughter is almost three years old. Do you know how smart she is? And she's not going to know what's going on? No. How stupid are you? I mean, I guess I'm pretty stupid. You're, you're ridiculous. I'm ridiculous? Yes. You're ridiculous. I can't even play a game. You're the true definition of an idiot. Hey! If that's what you want to call me. Yeah, that is what I want to call you. I actually want to call you a whole lot more, but... Yeah, I was about to say, that's probably the easiest one that you can call me. What else you got? I guess what happened happened. Yes. But I get the sense just watching that the most important thing in the world is not to you is not saving this relationship. It's no. Make, so it isn't. No, it's not. Well, if that's the case, and I, this is hard to accept. You have your two young children. You're 20 years old. But maybe that is where your mom is right. Not for interfering, although you can't stop parents from wanting to interfere for their children. But forget that. The issue is she may be right on the issue. If you, obviously, you cheated on her and, yeah. and you're saying it's not the most important thing in your life to you. If, this, if the family isn't the most important thing in the life, then 
what are you doing with the rest of your life? All right, it's just... I'm not asking you even to answer now. It's too big an issue to answer right now. Even for a television. It's too big to answer on the television. But you really got to think about this. Because yeah, he's do. now told you very clearly that this isn't the most important thing to him. And it isn't. You can't force it into him. So now you got to think, wow, I got my kids. What's the rest of my life going to be? Don't they have a right to grow up in a home where mom and dad love each other and the family is the most important thing? You have that right. We'll be back.